Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf here, one and only, and today I'm going to be playing some Twin Sprouts. Now, this is an indie game I found on itch.io. I've been looking for indie games a lot lately, <laughs> especially uh, Game Jolt, which was my first mistake because Game Jolt is full of a whole bunch of shit post games that aren't even good or interesting. But I went to itch.io and you know, I kind of found something that looks pretty interesting. I wanted to try out. But without further ado, let's get into it. Introduction to gameplay. Collect a seed. Um, plant seed on soil patch. Collect sun and water orbs. Feed the feed plants with water and sun. Collect joy. Okay. I get it. Oh, it's sort of like a multiplayer thing. Do your buddy would um be controlling the other side. I'm gonna be controlling this side. I just think they forgot the keys for uh, player two. I don't think they're... I mean, I have the controls over here. I just... Let me just plug in the controller. I think that would be a lot easier. Alright, so now I got the controller. I'm just going to be on the red, guys. Uh, I think I'll leave the blue there. So it's pretty much like playing with your friends and trying to like beat each other's scores. I collect some seeds. Where do I go? Okay, so I collect sun and um, water orbs, right? So I got a full sun. Okay, planted here. Up. I don't know if I did that right. Because I have to be up here. Oh, too much sun. Alright, I gave it some water. Okay, hold up. Gotta go get some water now. Like, this is actually a pretty interesting game to play when you're like, uh, like the family. Okay, I can jump in the water. I was, I was afraid that I was going to drown or something, but nah, I'm good. It definitely needs like a single player aspect too, you know, just for like fun, just to see if you can beat your score and everything like that. I think that would be quite fun too. Uh, let's go over here and gra oh god. Oh god. It's so difficult to jump. <laughs> What's this? Oh, another seed? Been so long since I used like a controller. Oh, there's the joy. Is full enough? Wait, wait. Did I just bounce off that thing? I feel like it just sent me flying into the air. Yeah, it did. Okay, so I can fly off the plants. That's pretty cool. It even gives you a meter on the side, just to let you guys know how far you gotta go. Uh, no, I'm gonna go down here just to see what else there is after I finish this. So you got six minutes. So it's... Wait, no. We got six minutes, is what I meant. I think you start out with like nine or ten, ten minutes, and you're supposed to uh, pretty much go up against each other. To see if you can get the most uh, score. It was actually pretty interesting. I like it. I like the concept. But it's not like one of those like long-term games you can actually 
you know, play. <laughs> just because you'll it'll, it'll probably get bored just doing the same level over and over. Ah, hold on. Wait, hold up. Hold on here. I just noticed something. There's a level gauge for this. Ah, okay, so it grows more and more. Okay. So that green thing, you guys see like the... Well, saw like the green bar that went around, right? You're leveling up your plant. As you, uh... Bring it new stuff. And the stats on it lowers after a while. Alright, this is actually pretty cool. I have no friends to play this with. It's, it's okay. <laughs> uh, it's not an online thing either. You guys have to, like... It's sort of like a land game. Let's just say that. Like, you guys gotta be physically on the keyboard and the mouse. The mouse controls the uh, right side. Uh, the arrow keys control the left side. A, W. This is D. Oh, wait. Why would my hands be off? Okay. Think about this. I have the mouse and WASD for for this, the right side. My hands are going to be stretching over the keyboard, and my friend's arms are going to be over my body. I, I, don't, I don't know about that. Oh, okay, my garden is getting sad. I think it's this one that's getting sad. Okay, so your stats go down. That's that's pretty interesting to know. Uh, see? So I can level it up to three. Okay, that's interesting. Let me go collect some more. I want to see how many levels I can actually put this thing on. Sadly, uh, we don't have, like, a lot of time. I don't think there's, like, really any speed boosting or anything like that. Oh, where is it? Oh, here it is. But this summons three. That's what a level two does. Yeah, I can't do nothing more with that. I don't think you can, like, customize it to where it would last, like, longer. Alright, cool. Alright, let's go over here. Hopefully we can get that, uh, jump boost. Actually, I think we're just cheesing our jump. <laughs> I think we're just on the... Pl like this surface out yeah we're just cheesing the jump that's what it is so we're on nothing right now yeah we were literally just cheesing the jump that's that's all it was yeah but yeah like i said it keeps getting boring doing the same map over and over again having the same plants if they were going to expand on this game they would definitely have to add a lot more maps and a lot more like different type of plants and probably, probably like a versus mode where you have to take over each other's plants or something like that. You know? Seems pretty interesting. Oh, actually. Your friend. Oh, say, so you guys are just on a different side of the map. I wonder what happens if I go over here then. I want to actually see before the time ends. Don't tell me I can steal his joy. 
I can. So it's not even just a race for like um, planting things. It's just pretty much once you plant something, it's just pretty much all around for everyone. You just got to go back and forth and get the points. That's odd. <laughs> It's a good thing we tested that out. Alright, so you can put in your name for the score. Oh, I guess my name is going to be F because it just froze. Oh, <laughs> somehow my name ended up having dead at the end. Alright, let's see. Oh no, it's a team effort thing. I think. <laughs> There is a solo, apparently. Um... I don't know. I don't think there is a solo, actually. If there is, I don't know how to get to it. I mean, it says... that there's a solo. Not really sure. Or maybe this is just, like, solo scores without, like, a, the group itself. So, yeah, that's some pretty interesting things behind this. I like it. It's an interesting idea. But there's not... just not a whole lot you can do right now. So hopefully they are expanding on the idea, you know, thinking of a couple of things. Because they could make, like, a different version of where it was just pretty much, like, creating plants that can, like, attack the other player, and the other player has to, like, do something to get rid of that plant, and, you know, plant your own right there, and it gives joy. It's sort of like something like that, just kind of like a small brain store, something like that. I'm not going to go full into it, <laughs> but, yeah, hope you guys check out the game yourself, and hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys next time on the next video. Till then, peace out.